welcome back to my channel. It's been quite a while. We've been really busy. We've been uh, filming out in Vegas for uh, Passes in America, which we'll see soon. We'll air it sometime. Um, probably after No Prep Kings airs. Um, it was long nights. We had uh, a little bit of mishap happen. One of part of our family, the Street Outlaws family, uh, Ryan Fellows, he had an unfortunate uh, incident on the street and uh, so I don't know it was a hard deal for all of us um, it hit us hard we're thinking about their family right now and hopefully I don't know it's hard. I mean, uh, being able to witness that it's just it's hard on a racer the whole street outlaws family we just I don't know just really hard on us right now coming uh, home we only have one day to recoup and get the trailer put together and me and Kai had a whole pass to get to Tulsa. We only had one day, one day to get here um, because he had his new car coming out and we needed to make it to Missouri for him to test his car. Um, he hasn't tested his car at all yet, so we were able, he's been running into trouble. Uh, we had trailer problems. Uh, the car wasn't, I mean, it, it had, uh, the wiring wasn't all the way done. Like he had to fix some things done on the car. It was just a whole mess. Everything was last minute, but he pushed real hard to get everything done. We were able to make one hit at uh, Larry's track, and uh, we were very fortunate. It was everything went well. We were happy with it, and uh, we were able to get on our way to uh, Tulsa. So about 12 o'clock uh, midnight, we break down again with the trailer. So stuck on the road. We were about, I don't know, eight miles from the track. Couldn't make it. So we slept on the side of the road. Uh, Kai woke up early in the morning to get some parts to fix the trailer. So that's what we did. Well, he did. And he had his guys help him. But he thrashed to try to make it here. And here we are in Tulsa, Oklahoma. I was able to get out here a little bit earlier than him. And uh, he just finally showed up with his car. He's uh, down a crew man right now, last minute. And that was that took a toll on him as well. Um, Adam wasn't able to make it, and that's like a huge deal, a huge part of him. So uh, I don't know with the new car out here, it's going to be really hard on him. But I got faith in him. He's 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 a smart guy. He's he's got our crew behind him, and uh, the whole team know is behind him. So I know we'll make it happen. He's got a, the car is badass, and um, I don't know. We do the best we can at this race. We have a lot going on, but before we came to the track, I had even worse news. Um, a good producer of us, um, more like a friend, passed away, and it was really hard on all of us. So, um, I don't know. We all go through things in life, and we all got to live with them and, and, and move on, but we're going to just try to dedicate this race for him, and I know he wouldn't want us to stop. He'd want to see us keep doing our deal out here so uh, this race is definitely going to be for him and uh, our prayers go out to his family as well but it's been really rough the last few weeks have been really rough not only that I lost a really close dog that I consider a little kid to me you know I had for seven years Blanco and he's been a part of my racing since I started your car so um, not being able to see him in the lounge after a run is it's been really hard this, this whole month has been super hard on me, so I'm just trying to trying to make make it through. Um, you never know when you be your day. You gotta live it the best you can, you know. We're here in Tulsa, and we're gonna do that.